Congratulations. After yesterday's win in the 203, was this a must-win situation for you? Yeah, I think so. I think I really wanted to break the world record. You know, I think I've been very close this year on the World Cup series. So to, to finally break the world record and, and, you know, get my name on top again is very, very important. And, uh, you know, obviously we had a good relay, I think, in the 204x2. Uh, very disappointing not to get the medal, but uh, very happy with the team performance. We were, I think we were very, very good. Okay, but let's talk about you and the 100 fly. Uh, can you compare this win to like the 200 free? For me, the 200 freestyle was bigger, I think, because of the, you know, the prestige associated with it, all the big names, and uh, also just for the fact that I haven't swum a 200 freestyle, and uh, you know, up against Ryan Lochte, Daniel Izatov, great champions who have won before in the, in the past, uh, and for me to come out there against them and, and beat them was very special to me. But uh, obviously, to break a world record is something I will always remember, of course. So yeah. As you just said, uh, you've been chasing Carter Tiskin's world record for a long time. Why do you think today you can make it? You know, I think on the World Cups, I was always, I wouldn't say holding back, but I was always uh, not so disappointed to, to miss. It wasn't a huge thing for me. You know, it was more important to break it on the big stage. You know, I think the real champions come out when the pressure's on and when the, the moments are big. And that's something that I thrive on and I, I look forward to the opportunity and the experience. So that's who I am. <laughs>